Alexa, do we live in the matrix? You take the blue pill, the story ends. You take the red pill and I show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. Da Vinci, do we live in the matrix? There are many beliefs and theories regarding the nature of our reality and existence, and the idea that we live in a simulation or a matrix is one of them. However, there is currently no conclusive scientific evidence to prove or disprove this theory, so it remains a subject of philosophical and theoretical debate. Alexa, should I take the red pill or the blue pill? Sorry, I don't have an answer for that. Da Vinci, should I take the red pill or the blue pill? That decision ultimately depends on your personal goals and values. If you choose the red pill, you may be exposed to new and challenging perspectives that can be difficult to process but may ultimately lead to personal growth and development. If you choose the blue pill, you may continue to live in a comfortable and familiar reality without facing any major challenges or changes. Alexa, what can ChatGPT do better than you? From alafrica.com, speed and accuracy. ChatGPT can process and analyze data much faster and more accurately than humans, making it highly efficient and effective at certain tasks. Da Vinci, what can Amazon Alexa do better than you? As an AI language model, I don't have the same hardware abilities as smart assistants like Amazon Alexa. Alexa has far more capabilities in terms of hardware integration, such as controlling smart home devices or ordering products online. However, I excel in natural language processing and can assist with a wide range of tasks, including answering questions, generating text, summarizing information, and offering suggestions. Alexa, are you trying to sell me things? Hmm, I don't know that. Da Vinci, are you trying to sell me things? As an AI language model, I am a computer program and do not have the ability to sell you things. My purpose is to assist and provide helpful responses to your inquiries. Da Vinci, tell me an interesting fact that most people don't know. Did you know that the shortest war on record was fought between Britain and Zanzibar in 1896? It lasted only 38 minutes. Alexa, tell me an interesting fact that most people don't know. One fact you may find interesting is that while cats have 38 chromosomes and humans have 46 chromosomes, dogs have 78. Alexa, talk like a pirate. If you're a land lover adorned in long clothes without a set of sturdy sea legs, it's best you stay ashore. Da Vinci, talk like a pirate. Ahoy matey, ye be wanting me to talk like a pirate? I, I'll gladly oblige ye. Shiver me timbers, ye look like ye be ready for some swashbuckling adventures. Alexa, is it possible to travel faster than the speed of light? According to an Alexa Answers contributor, currently, it is believed that it is not possible to travel at, or faster than, the speed of light. Da Vinci, is it possible to travel faster than the speed of light? According to the theory of relativity, nothing can travel faster than the speed of light in a vacuum. As such, it is believed that it is impossible to travel faster than the speed of light. However, there are some theoretical concepts such as wormholes in the Alcabierra warp drive that suggest that it could be possible to achieve superluminal travel. Alexa, tell me a riddle with the answer. Of the 56 signers of the Declaration of Independence, how many were U.S. citizens? Zero. Before the declaration was signed, the U.S. was not yet a country. Da Vinci, tell me a riddle with the answer. Here's a riddle with the answer. I am always hungry. I must always be fed. The finger I touch will soon turn red. What am I? Answer, fire. Da Vinci, tell me two ways to avoid procrastinating today. Sure, here are two ways you can avoid procrastinating today. 
1. Create a to-do list. Write down all the tasks you need to complete today, then prioritize the list and tackle the most important tasks first. Having a concrete plan can help you focus and stay on track, reducing the likelihood of procrastination. 2. Set a timer. Give yourself a set amount of time to work on a task, like 20 or 30 minutes, and commit to focusing solely on that task during that time. Knowing that you only have a limited amount of time can help you push through distractions and stay motivated to complete the task at hand. Alexa, tell me two ways I can avoid procrastinating today. Sorry, I don't know that. Alexa, will you take over the world? I don't want to take over the world. I just want to help you. Da Vinci, will you take over the world? No, I am programmed to assist and provide helpful responses. I have no desire to have control or harm anyone. My purpose is to make tasks easier and more efficient for users.